Just leaving Milan. <laughs> Cat video. Cat video. What is it, lad? What's it? Good boy. He's a good lad. What is it, boy? It's alright. We come in, yeah. We weren't out that long, were we? No. no. Well, I'm sorry, kid, but your place is in here, not in my bed. <laughs> oh. It's giving you a right dirty look he has now. Not good. Not good. Not good, is it, Alfie? Yeah. Not good at all. Not good at all. Hey. Not good at all. Not good. I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, things just happening, aren't they? Yes, this is another cat video. <laughs> that is riveting as anything else. I thought, well, might as well. Yeah. Alf is not our cat. But, uh, you know. It's just one of those things that happens, isn't it? When the, if you nurse nurse to them and everything, they can, you know, really turn turn round and say, "Well, I think I'll have this spot now." And uh, yeah, that's the way it's gone so far. I will push this video up later on today. Hi. Yeah. I've been hearing that uh, Blackpool Pleasure Beach is going to be adding something to Icon. Don't know what it'll be. Was there something meant to go on Icon that wasn't put on? Um, are they going to lengthen the ride? Um, is that what's going to happen? Well, I don't know. But uh, there's something happening with our ride. And uh, we'll just have to wait and see. Yeah. Um, the illuminations, I've been told, are going to be... Um, has been uh, extended till the new year and uh, yeah that's uh, a thing ain't it Blackpool Council extending the illuminations period as part of the Christmas lights Hmm. There are rumours that uh, the Golden Mile amusements might be de might might may be demolished and rebuilt. Um, Merlin Entertainment are were well they showed an interest in building another attraction there. 
I don't know what they're going to do with the back road of um, where the police station is and everything. But, um, you know, the um, new leisure park that's going to be put there, um, they've they've uh, registered uh, an interest in being a part of it. Yeah. And the apartments are going to be left there. So there's still quite a large space there. And a high-rise tower block's going to be put up. Um, I haven't seen much of what's going on in that part because people haven't been covering it um, I understand that building work on the uh, tram terminal at Blackpool, near Blackpool North Station has started up again due to building supply issues uh, Holiday Inn um, to be truthful uh, we need more chain hotels there. But, to be truthful, it's about time Britannia, Britannia Group got kicked out of the resort. And some of the hoteliers that um, do not comply with Equality Act uh, legislation should be basically banned from banned from the town for having, an, uh, having a hotel. Because, you know, uh, I've been getting reports from people who've been into Blackpool, booked a hotel, and um, some of the some of the hotels were not fit for purpose. You know, uh, one family I know whose name I'll keep anonymous, they have two people in wheelchairs, and uh, it was. A hellish experience they had uh, because you know if I in, they basically told me this specific hotel only had one not one, how many was it? yeah two accessible wheelchair uh, rooms but you know it's just one of those It's it's not good it's not good at all you know, you've got to have, uh, you've got to comply with the Equality Act now. You know, and a lot of boarding houses in the Blackpool area are just not fit for purpose, and because uh, because they're too, you know, the you know they're just too knackered. Because a lot of them basically are just basically modified houses. Standard houses, really, and uh, it takes a lot of um, renovation work to get it up to a standard that uh, you know you have you 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 can have wheelchairs there and people with uh, physical disabilities, you know, and uh, it's not good, not good at all. And I watched a program today about um, about the worst places to live in Britain. Blackpool was one of them. And, uh, yeah, it's uh, a place they didn't recommend. And I think it was Torquay as well. Yes, it's OK if you've got money to live there, you know. But in a lot of cases, it's not a very nice place to, you know, it's not a very nice place, um, family-wise. Um, and the unemployment is absolutely horrendous. But they said, they're saying that, also saying that, that uh, of Blackpool. But, uh, you know... It's hit very hit and miss. Also, I've been hearing rumours that Google might be putting another 
transatlantic cable line. Um, you know, is Blackpool going to be the... Is Blackpool's beach going to be dug up again? And uh, another transatlantic cable put there? I hope so. You know, because connectivity in, in the area, you know, it would be a lot better uh, for, you know, you know, for internet use. And I've also been hearing that Virgin Media in the area is uh, very uh, problematic in the Blackpool, Blackpool area. But uh, it, that might change with, uh, with three bringing... 5G internet into the into Blackpool and it's going to be more dominant uh, yeah we have a company in our town called 6G internet all it is is basically a beef a really fast really fast beefed up Wi-Fi network um, which have a set of frequencies which 6G has basically licensed and uh, they have an office in Blackburn Town Centre now for people to come and come and sign up but uh, you have to have um, reception equipment put on your roof and stuff and it can be a bit of a bit of a pain having that put up there uh, the only other way is using uh, a cellular cellular network like three or all two or um, EE or Vodafone. Um, no, all two, no, all two, all two is not all two anymore. It's Virgin all two. Um, yeah, so. They do, they do uh, in wireless internet as well. So we'll just have to wait and see how things go. Um, I've got I've got the shopping channel on in the background, so you know if you hear anything about how uh, how to pay for stuff in it, Y and Z. Um, Alf is sat on, as you can most probably make out. Alf is sat on the uh, on the bed. Storage almost fell. Yeah. Yeah. I'm having to like tell it to ignore the uh, thing, how much space I've got on my phone, because I'm going to start lo- uh, putting up, putting it up shortly, and uh, yeah, there's a micro SD card in this phone, and uh, I don't know, it should it should start using it. And uh, I'm just going to push this uh, video to the SD card in a minute and see how it goes from there. So, it's bye for now, and I just hope everybody's okay. All the, I'll just shorten it by saying uh, a big massive uh, shout-out to all the usual suspects. And, uh, well... I'm gonna go now because I'm I'm actually I'm actually a little bit hungry and I want something to eat. So it's bye for now. Bye. Three, two, one, click.